How can we use science to treat rare genetic diseases? Hi, I'm Catherine Inson, and I'm a research scientist at the University of Toronto in the laboratory of Amy Ramsey. 20 years ago, Amy took the genome of a mouse, selected the GRIN1 gene, and made a mutation of that gene. She studied the mouse when it grew up and found that it had cognitive dysfunction, motor skills deficits, and seizures. Since then, patients around the world have been diagnosed with GRIN1 mutations, and they show largely the same symptoms as the mouse does. Now, we can use this mouse model to help point us in the direction of whether there are any special diets, any drugs that are already on the market, any new drug therapies, or in the future, any gene therapies that can help improve the lives of GRIN1 patients. Going forward, we're going to be taking personalized medicine to the next level by taking individual specific GRIN1 mutations and introducing them to a mouse model using CRISPR-Cas9 technology. And this will allow us to hone in on truly individual personalized therapies.